Hi everybody, it's Paul. We're going to be making some changes on our tuning pegs this year. We're changing the button and I want to explain the entire changeover. When I started making guitars, Gibson and Fender had their own tuning peg buttons and it was very normal for guitars of a new manufacturer to have a specific button shape that was part of the look of the guitar and this year we're finally going to put that button shape on our guitars. We did some last year. With the NF53 these tuning pegs came out on the guitar so we've already been in process with this new tuning peg shape and with the John McLaughlin we had these pegs on it as well. Uh, I have a way of exaggerating things to make a point like if you put a rubber nut and a rubber bridge on a guitar you're not going to have a whole lot of high end. It's the same thing with the tuning pegs. If you put a big heavy weight on the headstock it asymmetrically weights the neck in a way that's not musical, kind of robs the mid-range from the guitar and so we're making these buttons um, light, very very lightweight to reduce the weight on the headstock. I want to show you this drawing that was done in 1980 and on the drawing is the original headstock and tuning peg button shape that I had dreamed about and this is what we're going to. We love this shape with anything new yeah, people are going to be venomously opposed to it. Then it'll be, yeah, it'll be a pretty much against it. And then it'll be the accepted norm and people think it's beautiful. This has been with me since 1980 and I'm really proud that we're doing this. With the tuning pegs, the guitars that don't have tremolo don't, don't have locks now. And there's a lot of little things that we've done to make sure that the guitars have a, a worm and a gear that are still very snug but not overly tight. And all this has an effect on the tone of the guitar, but this is the original drawing and we're going to this now. And I'm very happy about it. And we do two versions. We do a cream button and a black button. You've got to look at the website about which tuning pegs are going on which guitars, but there's a change coming and we are happy about it. See ya, bye.